Saturday and we just finished an engagement shoot it went really well it was a co-worker of Brian's and she was super sweet and her fiance was as well so it went really well we were in where are we in Philly, in Philly. I love doing shoots in Philly because there's so many places to go like so many and a lot of times you have places that you want to go and when you try to go back because a previous shoot went so well you know it could not look the same as what you were used to yeah so a lot of times you can try to go back to a place that you went to before and had a successful shoot and it not quite looked the same so it's kind of tricky but how I account for that is I like to go to places that have a lot of different little spots that you can hit up just in case one spot that you went to before doesn't quite work out um, like if the Sun is just far too bright and that's what happened here but um because one of the spots i thought i would go and take them to wasn't going to work out i think the last time i was in that particular spot it was in the fall and now it's the summer and it was super bright in that one particular spot but because this is such a good space you can just walk a couple of blocks down and find something really good just the same anyway so now we are finished up with our shoot the kids are at mom and dad's house um we have one more shoot in the afternoon which if i was diligent and on top of things i just go home and start this edit so that that's what you're gonna do that's what, <laughs> that's what would be good that's what you're gonna do. and i could be on top of things and still ready for school you guys school is about to start for us or turn over for us um i had a lot of catching up to do ryan thinks it was no big deal but it was a big deal to me i thought i was gonna have all summer to get ready to move over into our next grade levels and whatever new curriculum or resources and things and with camp and everything that did not happen so uh, when i finished up with camp gave myself a couple of days to rest and then I tried to get right back to it so that I could go ahead and move us over um, I definitely feel like I haven't had a summer but that's okay <laughs> that's okay we haven't, done anything. we haven't done anything we haven't been to the beach we haven't any type of summer with the darn fun. Way, you didn't even go. right I mean it was nice to have the field trips with that went along with um, camp so for the kids, they probably definitely felt like they had a summer. Plus my kids have fun all the time. So, I mean, it's not a huge deal. And then they got to go to Darney Park. I was not feeling well. Um, so I missed that field trip because I had strep throat. So um, Brian, it was great though. It, it worked out well because I had asked Brian from the beginning if he could come with us to Darney Park. So he ended up going and taking the kids himself. So I think he vlogged. Um, a little bit going there. I was so sad that I couldn't go, but I know they had a really, really good time. Yeah, you vlogged, right, Brian? I did. He did. We had a good time. He did. He took all three kids and he vlogged. All three kids. All three kids. By myself. <laughs> in a huge park. Water park. It was fun, though. They had a good time. Let me show you. Mm -hmm. I'll insert some clips here. So yeah. we just pulled up to Dorney. We got a vlog today because mommy couldn't make it. It's Tuesday, but Serena has been she's um, sick. Yeah, she's been sick. It started Friday night. She didn't get out of bed all day Saturday, all day Sunday. Hi. Yesterday she got better. She went to the doctor and got a prescription. But this was gonna be a lot. It's in the hey everyone, today. this is our video. This is my daddy. Okay. Sit my back. daddy Crocodile. Sit back, sit back. From Pennsylvania. And mommy's at home because she's sick. She's getting better. 
It just would have been a lot for her to walk around all day in this heat and then be ready. This is the last week of camp. Stop it, girl. This is the last week of camp. So it would have been a lot when for her to do that. When our camp sees Timothy, we're going to go play some rides. Okay. Like, okay. Um, all right. Sit back. All right. No. Yeah, so we're about to go. We're about to go in the park now. No. <laughs> Bye. You all excited? Yeah. Not that excited. Not, not that excited about the rules. We gotta get Cam on a roller coaster today. No, 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 no. Definitely. Nah, 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 <laughs> nah, nah, bro, nah. Kendall, come on. Gotta find my way back home. I've been away too long. Gotta find my way back home. Man, you having fun? Take the video for mommy. <laughs> Babe, you're not gonna believe this. Kendall just got on this huge slide. So now, of course, Cameron wants to do it with him. Again? Put your, again? Again? Okay, so now we are getting out of Philly and we're going to find something to eat because I'm hungry before our next shoot. How about these okay. Did you eat them today? I, I saved them. Did you miss me? You missed me too? Did you miss me? Yeah. Savannah. That's gross. No, no, I like it. No, you don't. You eat sauce on things, not on your finger. <laughs> so, mommy's over here. Dad is over there. Mom, how old are you? Not yet. It's not your birthday yet. 21st of August. 64. On Tuesday, Nana will be... How old? How old did she say? 61. 61 on Tuesday. What about Papa? How old is Papa? Don't forget. Don't forget her. Do you see Cameron? This has been going on ever since he got back from summer camp. He's always doing some version of the shoot or the floss, literally. The boy can't stand still now. Papa, how old are you? Kendall, how old am I? 59. 59. Savannah. 